Hey there everybody, uh, for those who haven't met me already, my name is Helen Wells and I work for the Take That Step team alongside my colleagues Fiona Porter and Paula Jameson. Um, it is open to everybody over the age of 18 who have a BMI of 30 or over and work or live in the North Yorkshire region or are registered with the GP at the North Yorkshire Hamilton District. You can register if you're interested by emailing us on take that step team at hamilton.gov.uk or calling us on 016 09767241. The information should be just on your screen and if you're watching on YouTube, you can look in the description box as well. Um, what follows this short video I'm telling you a little bit more about the programme and showing you some healthy habits that could change your life for the better. A healthy lifestyle is all about balance, making good food choices in your diet, okay, and keeping and staying active, all right? If you do this, you can still afford to have the occasional treat. Remember, it's not called cheating, it's called treating. It's nearly Easter. Hope you enjoy. Bye-bye. Due to COVID-19, the weekly workshops are now on Zoom. This gives us a chance to meet other people, albeit virtually, listening to advice and offering your own. We talk about topics such as setting goals, energy balance, habits, flexible eating, and take a look at calorie content. You can even listen while exercising, just like Diane here in the yellow coat. For those not fortunate to have a treadmill in the garage, we can also offer Zoom by exercise classes. These are for all abilities. As well as mine, I do four times a week. Fiona and Paula do their own. You can come as many as you want. As well as exercising at home, try and get your daily walks in. Being outside is really good for you. It's cold at the moment, so try and wrap up and invest in some decent boots. Some days are lovely, some are not so. If you've got a dog, you've got no excuse, but take care and try not to slip over. And it's snowing. Oh my god. So it's raining outside. I don't really want to go out. I've already been wet once. The dog does not want to go out. And I've got 2,000 steps to make my 10,000 goal. So what do I do? I dance it out. I think I did about 3,000 steps and burnt loads of calories doing this workout. Yeah, I'm not very good, it doesn't matter. Nobody's looking, well, you are now, but I had fun. And I can tell you what, I was sweating when I finished. But it was really good, I love it. She's called Mad Fit, find her on YouTube. I also enjoy yoga. I follow Yoga with Adrian. It can be really relaxing as well as taxing. It has improved my flexibility as well as my mental well-being. Fortunately, at the moment, headstands are still out of my comfort zone. Make sure your fridge is fully stocked full of nice healthy foods, vegetables and salads, so you can make lots of go-to healthy lunches, snacks all the time. Here are a few of my favourites. Notice that some of them, yeah, they are quite high in calories, but they're also full of healthy nutrients that will keep you full and full of energy for the day. I will be posting some recipes shortly too. Oops, how did they get on there? My daughter is a very good baker. If you've ever been on the radio, this is Fiona chatting to Amy Ogden on Radio Teeth about her experiences. It. So my original aim was to get fit, but actually through the through the course of it, I realized that there was a lot more that I needed from it than just, just fitness. And actually my, my um, mental health was quite low at the start of it. Um, I lost my mum and things, um, put on an awful lot of weight through that. Um, and I don't think I'd really appreciated how far it had gone until I sort of started the program and started really getting into it. Just the attitude of everyone taking it. I've been to Helen's classes, I've been to Fiona's. It really encouraged you. It was never about judgment. It was never about you've got to do this, you've got to do that. It was about encouraging you to make small changes. That's it. So what would you say to anybody who's maybe sat at home listening to this now and thinking, I want to do that? Just absolutely go for it. Because I, I was apprehensive when I first started because I thought, oh, they're going to be judgy. They're going to tell me to do this and tell me to do that. But it's just such a supportive environment. 
it. It's all about them figuring out what's right for you and you working with them. Just absolutely go for it. Like it really has made such a such a huge difference to my life. It's absolutely amazing. So just like Fiona, you'll be supported on your lifestyle journey by appropriately qualified and experienced health and well being officers, myself included. So just as she said, just go for it. Make a change. This is Diane, one of my newest clients, just chatting about the scheme and how she's enjoying it. I love it. I enjoy it. I'm I'm gutted when I'm at work and I miss them. Yeah. Um, um, Still trying to get the little one to join in, but Joe Wicks (laughs) put him off. Um, (laughs) I have said you're not as hard as Joe. (laughs) So when do you... Wednesday morning ones are a little bit more. Yeah, I was going to say they're a little bit harder, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you're going, to, you know, no, you're doing more than one a week and you're coming to the Zoom, you know, how do you, how are you finding the, um, you know, the, the tips and advice as well? I'm, I'm enjoying that because there's a lot of things that I've forgotten and a lot of things I've stopped doing yeah. where, where when we're talking and other people are giving your ideas and stuff as well. It's like a sharing thing as well. Yeah. So th- that's nice. And, and yeah, I'm out working, but you you know, it's nice to talk to people who are in the same boat, who are trying to lose some weight. And <laughs> So there's no time like the present. Don't let the opportunity make a positive change in your life slide by. And I really hope that I'll see you soon. <laughs>